Hello Bucks fans! Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss Bucks first-hand news and leave your like to strengthen the channel. On Friday night, the Miami Heat had a less-than-ideal start to the second half of their season. Miami suffered a loss in the February 24 game against the Milwaukee Bucks. Milwaukee was able to dominate the Heat, winning every quarter of the game and achieving a victory of 128-99. After his team's dominant performance, Bucks coach Mike Budenholzer was questioned about Bam Adebayo, the only all-star for the Miami Heat this season. I think he's clearly more aggressive, looking to attack, looking to get to the basket. But he's taking a lot of tough shots, a lot of elbow jumpers, coach Bud told reporters. He's really grown as a scorer. We have to figure out if we can make things harder for him. But to be between him and the basket, to keep him from getting offensive rebounds and keep him off the free throw line, those were some positives defensively against Adebayo. Budenholzer's Bucks were able to hold the 25-year-old star to just 18 points on 17 shots. In addition to focusing on Adebayo, Milwaukee's coach explained that overcoming the high volume of screens that Miami sets was a point of emphasis for his team. There are so many screens when you play against the Heat, whether it's on the ball or off the ball, he said. You have to be committed. You have to be hard to screen. You have to keep coming. You have to be disciplined. Overall, a lot of good defensive possessions for the group, and that's what we have to continue doing. Kevin Love discusses disappointing Heat debut One of the main storylines leading up to the Heat's return to action was Kevin Love's debut. Miami signed Love last week after he was waived by the Cleveland Cavaliers. His first game in a Heat uniform didn't make much of an impact. Of course, Miami nearly lost by 30 points. Additionally, Love didn't score any points in the loss, missing all four of his attempts. He did, however, grab eight rebounds and didn't commit any turnovers. After his debut, Love spoke to the press explaining that his first game as a Heat member was good despite his performance. Obviously, it was good to be back after a month, Love said via Bally Sport Sun, Heat. Rhythm, getting my wind back and how the game unfolded was pretty ugly. Love started against the Bucks on Friday and defended Brook Lopez early in the game. He gave some insight into his role on the team. Leave your like on this video to keep up to date with everything that happens at Bucks Thanks. Continuing. They wanted a little bit of the space I bring, especially at the four position, to help Bam out on the outside, guard Lopez. Come out and show on defense. I think they wanted more size inside there. Cody Zeller talks about his heat debut love wasn't the only player to debut against the Bucks. The game also. In conclusion. The Miami Heat had a tough start to the second half of their season with a lopsided loss to the Milwaukee Bucks. Despite the additions of Kevin Love and Cody Zeller, who made their Heat debuts in the game, Miami struggled to find their footing against a focused Milwaukee team. Bucks head coach Mike Budenholzer praised Miami's all-star Bam Adebayo, but also shared his team's strategy for limiting his impact on the game. Moving forward. The Heat will need to regroup and find ways to overcome their opponents' defensive tactics and improve their overall performance on both ends of the court. Put your opinion in the comments as it is very important for Bucks. I update you at any time with the latest news from Bucks.